Hey guys, and welcome back to Quality Nails by Qua. Today we are doing another poly gel set, and today I will be attempting to ombre two colors. Um, again, I'm new to poly gel, so I've been really trying to see what all I can do when using poly gel. Again, I told you guys when I applied poly gel to my clients, I used to do a poly gel overlay. So me just practicing um, using tips, these are the steps that I do. Um, I've watched quite a few videos watching the girls do their sets. And in this set, I'll be making a press on. So as you guys can see, I already have on like a full cover tip stiletto. And I'm just sitting here following them, getting them um, to the shape that I'm looking for. So pretty much with this, these tips, I can actually foul them in the beginning really good versus when I'm using a half a tip and they pop right on off. Um, I used the peel off method. I told you guys with that, I made my own peel off base where I just mix top coat, base coat, and some oil in an old bottle that you no longer use. Probably just don't have a little, just have a little bit in it. Most of the time, I have a lot of bottles of base and top coat that just have a tiny bit to the bottom. I just pour them all into one and make my own peel off base. So, again, I'm just sitting here just filing, shaping, trying to get some etching to the top, kind of blend that cuticle area in um, just so I can get started on my application. So I hope you guys have been loving the videos I've been bringing so far. I do have more coming. I'm getting more used to trying to film and um, figuring out which camera keeps me in focus the most. So therefore, this is doing a lot better than the first video I put out. I don't know who would text me in the middle of um, doing this. But again, I want to thank you guys for joining me today, watching me do this blue ombre set. I'll be using some 3D flowers um, in this design as well. So if you guys are interested, make sure you keep on watching. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe and hit that like video so you do not miss up on any more videos like this. So I'll let you guys continue to watch the prep and I'll be back once we start the application. Now you guys know with applying poly gel, you would need to go in with the base coat first so that your poly gel can stick to your nail. So this is one step you definitely do not, do not want to skip, okay? So I'm going in with this pine um, base coat that came with the poly gel set that I got off Amazon. And I'm just gonna go apply this to my nails and then go ahead and cure them for 45 seconds. Now, I'm pretty sure it probably supposed to go for 60 seconds, but again, my light goes for 45 seconds. I haven't had any um, problems with it so far, so therefore, we just go in for one round. So after this, we will then go in and start the application of the poly gel. I'll show you guys all the supplies that I will be using today. I got all of them off Amazon. Not sure if I linked it in my Amazon store yet, but I will make sure I go ahead and do so. It's been a while since I put any items in there and I forget how to work it. So again, I'll get to doing that just to make it easier if you guys are interested in using any of the items that I use today okay 
so this is what I have and these are the supplies here so I believe we're using Swaziland today both sets I really like their glitters they're very easy to um, manipulate now when it comes to this Mia secret I'm not sure um, I think it's better me personally to use the smaller brush and as you guys can see I use a bigger brush when I'm applying my poly gel um, it does make the process a lot faster but when it comes to that me a secret I believe using the, the smaller brush is much better with it it needs something with um, some thicker bristles just to manipulate it because these here smaller brushes they're very soft and it works a lot better with this as you guys can see how it's almost like applying acrylic using a bigger brush so those of you who probably having trouble with it or just don't like to use so many balls I believe just trying to use a bigger brush may help you out a lot more okay so these nails are pretty much simple I'll be applying the glitter on um, two tips um, well not two three tips and then I'm gonna do a ombre on two nails okay so I'll let you guys again sit back and watch this application and not ramble all video and I'll be back towards the end of the video if you guys again like this video make sure you go ahead and thumbs up so I can bring you guys more videos like this to come
So until next time, guys, thank you, thank you, thank you.